is up? Lupino has gaming here. Uh, today we're bringing you another Elden Ring tutorial. Today we're going to be uh, talking about the new patch that just dropped about Elden Ring and its implications for PvP. Um, so it's just going to be a quick little overview because I know there's a lot of misinformation uh, going around right now. A lot of people are not knowing what to make, you know, you know, like uh, heads or tails of the notes, I guess, I guess you could say. Uh, but before we get into it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Hit that um, that subscribe uh, button and subscribe. Uh, ring the bell as well because uh, I'm going to be doing way more um, patch coverage coming up in the near future. Um, yeah, so, uh, and make sure to subscribe. Okay, uh, now let's get into it. So, um, the first patch we have, and this is going to be just rapid fire, just, we're going to be just off the cuff here. Uh, I'll just give you my thoughts. So they they carried the bell bearings over into new game. I don't like that particularly. I kind of like earning it um, whenever I restart a character. So I mean that's that's weird. Um, I don't know sound effects. I mean who cares about that? Fix the bug where equipment can be changed. Make quit menu. I've never had that happen to me. I don't know. I don't know what that is. Uh, fixed war cry was applied to a weapon that was not the target of the skill. Uh, sounds like a dirty. Good. I think war cry is actually one of the more broken ashes of war, so it's probably a good idea. I'm kind of glad I never encountered that. To be honest, sounds pretty busted. Um, fixed with above here, which was for recovery. Sometimes I'm not gonna expect. Okay, I don't. Slow roars. I mean, those are those ashes are pretty broken too. I'm kind of glad they nerfed that. Uh, fixed determination RKR skill does not wear off on certain weapons. That sounds cool. I think I kind of like that glitch just because, like, I like to have my weapon white. I wish they could reskin weapons, but I mean, it's kind of sad that they're just patching out all the stuff that people like. Kind of crazy, but whatever. Fix the bug in which some attacks of Ice Spear on Guard Bolt. Now, this is a change I actually do agree with. I'm really, I was really salty trying to, I tried to do this video with um, this build I made. Uh, I haven't seen anyone do it, but it's it's basically like a bloody shield crash fingerprint shield build, like Juggernaut character. And yeah, this just would cuck me constantly. I just, I couldn't get any footage. I swear to God, every single invader, you guys, no joke, had an icy spear shotel like every invader in the game it's fucking ridiculous i can't believe like all invaders are just straight up fucking hackers it's actually despicable honestly so good to see that one gone i have to fix the bug with skills to be reduced using golden valve I don't, I don't know what that actually was i don't know what that does fix the moonlight okay this is I used to, if you guys remember my pvp bid, uh, b video this is my favorite weapon so i'm really stoked about this so i wish it had better tracking honestly i wish this had like stars of ruin tracking I, more spells should have better tracking honestly in this game i think they all should like because they just miss you know kind of suck. Like, what's the point of doing a magic bow if all just misses? Uh, fix the seppuku. I, I don't know what, I don't know what that is. Seppuku. Is that that crossword game? More of this stuff. I've never seen that Ash War. It's probably not relevant. Fix the bug and status effect is applied to Horlu Earthshaker. See, that was another video that got cut. I was going to make a video where I did Madness uh, Horlu Earthshaker, but that's just in the garbage now. Thank you, Vromsoft. Uh, fix the bug where Waves of Darkness would not have a spinning cleave. I have literally never heard of this attack in the game, so it's probably not relevant. Uh, unintended motions to be played when switching to a different sorcery or incantations. Um, I don't know what that means, so we're just going to keep going. Fix the bugs, magma shot and rolling, magma and riding. Now this, this is a good change. It did, I did notice that it costed a lot of FP when I was riding on my magma build. I did notice that, so glad to see that fixed. That was probably up there for me, honestly. 
Uh, okay, speeding right along. Oh shit, this is supposed to be a five minute video. Uh, okay, uh, Gollum Talbot, no one uses that. Fix the pulley cross with left hand, blah blah blah. Oh my god, fix the bug, okay good, fuck this boss, she has too much HP. Uh, guard boost, no one gives a shit about that. Fix the bu a bug about the Riker boss. I always like to skip that boss anyway. I never do it. Fuck that boss. He's too hard. Uh, defeating boss stars. Okay, these are are these just all bug fixes? These are all just bug fixes. Hold on. Fix a bug to improve the stability of online multiplayer. I do kind of like it when like the invaders that I don't kill in less than two minutes just di get disconnected. Honestly, so I'm gonna miss that a lot. Cause like honestly, if like I can't like get them like killed in 60 seconds, like they're really just pissing me off. Cause they're probably just doing some survival like bullshit, and like you know I can't catch them. So it's honestly like kind of nice. I'm really, I hope that's in there. I don't know what this exactly means, but I hope they didn't change that. Uh, what else did I miss here? Uh, boss invasions. Ooh, but I, I'm, I can't believe they fixed that. I haven't even seen any epic trolling boss invasion YouTube videos yet. That's kind of a shame. It's like my favorite thing I look forward to every time. Um, but yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Uh, please leave a like and subscribe for some more dank PvP uh, tutorials. And hey, fingers crossed that Bloodhound Step is going to survive another patch.